everybody, it's Brittany. So today I'm gonna be doing my August favorite. Anyway, so let's go ahead and jump right in. First item, one of these I got um, about a year ago and the other one I just got for the month of August are Z palettes. I love Z palettes. Um, they come empty and they come in different colors and I got this hot pink one which for some reason is a little thicker than the cheetah print one. I don't know. I got this one off MakeupGeek.com on her website and it was a couple dollars cheaper which I don't know why that was. And then I got this one on the actual Z palette website which was $20. I just love them because I don't travel a lot but when I do or when I go spend the night places these are just my go-to guys and I'm kind of building my neutrals in this one. They're magnets and um, the way these work is that you have to find eyeshadows that have magnets on the back or if not you buy little magnets from um, Walmart and stick them on the back and you can put anything in here I mean I have these Makeup Forever big old eyeshadows and then I have you know MAC and Makeup Geek and Okay, my next item on the list is going to be one I actually just got, but I already love this, and I did a tutorial with this, and it is the Too Faced Bronzed and Beautiful Palette, <clears throat> which is a bronzing palette, and you do have these four colors, and I took it out, but it comes with a face primer as well, and I love makeup items that come with extra things. I just think that's so price conscious and I love this because it even comes with learn how to create your perfect bronze these little cards I love how Too Faced does this so the four colors this comes with is chocolate soleil which golly it smells so good if this was edible I would have eaten it already it, it smells like powdered chocolate it's so cool and then it has your highlighter in powdered sun which is this golden beautiful type color which I don't know if you're going to be able to see this but um, it's this beautiful gold color and I have it as my highlight right now which is above my cheeks okay and then it has uh, Sun Bunny which is this bronzer right here which is like a light brown and then a dark brown then it has Snow Bunny which is this pink and for my highlighter I mixed it with this and this pink, this light pink and brown, which these are just so gorgeous. I love these bronzers. They just give the most beautiful sheen and glow to your face, especially if you have olive, olive skin like me. Um, I think it would work pretty well. So that was the bronzed and beautiful. <laughs> guys my next item is this brush now this is a Sigma brush and Sigma is a company of brushes that you have to order online and they are amazing now this is the uh, 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 this is the E35 and this is just a blending brush you see in my videos just if I have color up here I just blend it back and forth just like that and sorry this is dirty I need to wash my brushes tonight actually and these were easy to wash. This is my first Sigma brush, so I can't really say it about all their brushes, but this one's easy to wash. It dried pretty quick, and the, the brush part is really soft. Really enjoyed it. So Sigma brushes, love it. I want to get some more really, really soon. So if you've tried Sigma brushes, let me know. What are your favorite Sigma brushes? so I know what to get. Alright guys, next item. Okay, this next item came in my glam bag. If you saw my glam bag for August review, I love this lip gloss. It's just the perfect kind of pink. Um, it's not too dark. I love the smell too. It's not too light. It's just so pretty. And I really think it would look good on any skin tone. And this, honestly, the stain consistency was really pretty. If I wanted to repurchase this, I don't know how because the actual company is My Glam. So maybe they'll allow me to purchase this on the website. But it's just this baby 
um, pink and it smells so good and I enjoy a good pink. As y'all know, I love pink lipsticks, glosses, love, love, love. So this is my next time. Okay, my next item are these Urban Decay Beauty with an Edge eyeshadows. Now this has come out recently. Um, the line has some of their old shadows and then they have some of their newer shadows. And these are awesome because you can actually take these out up here and put it in their palettes. Now you can put it in your own palette. You have to buy one of their empty palettes and put them in there. But let me see if I can pop one out for you. I could not do this to save my life um, when I first tried, but anyways, these pop out. Okay, these pop out, which I am not able to do this at the time right now. I promise you, it's probably easy. I'm just not good at life, so that's why I probably can't get it open. Anyway, but these pop out, so it's just this little quad, or just a little pan, and then you put it inside um, their empty palette that you can buy and these are just beautiful I have the color free love okay, and I've used this a couple times which is just this beautiful beautiful um, it's kind of pinky orangey type of color and then I have the color snatch which is my new favorite um, highlight color for the inside um, it's like a pink Peach, which uh, has little gold flecks in it. It's just so beautiful. Okay, so my next item is a drugstore item. It is the Revlon Photo Ready um, Cream Blush. And I have the color Flushed. And you kind of saw this on my drugstore, top drugstore items. And this was the newbie that was going to let you know how... I liked it. I love this. I thought it was just so pretty and you can build it up to this beautiful, beautiful, uh, you know, pink colored blush. And I love it. I just thought it set so well. It stayed on really well. And I'm putting this on top of bronzer. I um, thought it was so beautiful. And it's multi-use as well. Um, I tried this on my lips and it just gave me the beautiful little rosy glow a rosy color it really is just when you think of the color when you think of blush okay this is the color I think about this is just a blush a rosy glow it's just so beautiful and they have other colors as well but you know I saw the hot pink and I had to have it okay so I am a person who my hands have to be soft at all times. I hate my hands feeling dry. Same goes for my lips. My lips, they can never ever be chapped or dry. It will drive me nuts. If I'm doing something or talking to someone and I notice that my lips are dry, I will excuse myself, go and apply chapstick. Now I've had my share of chapsticks and I hate chapstick so much sometimes because I feel like sometimes I feel like I'm just putting a layer over my chapness instead of a chapstick going in and correct. Kind of like if you have a bad smell and you just spray potpourri spray you're just putting a scent over the scent but I want something to go in and get rid of that you know so this chapstick not only are they so cute and just so, um, you know, versatile because you can throw them in your bag. But they smell so good. And I'm talking about the EOS. And I know everybody knows about these. And if you don't, go out and get one at Walmart. They are these lip balms that are so stinking cute. And this one is in the color mint. And it smells like mint as well. Mmm, it smells like mint ice cream that I love. Okay guys, I so hope you enjoyed that, August favorites. If you have any questions, let me know. Please don't hesitate. And uh, what's your August favorites? What were you just reaching for all the time this month? Let me know. Rate, comment, subscribe. Send me ideas. What do you want? Okay guys, love you guys. Be blessed. Have an amazing, amazing end of your August. And let's kick
kick September in the butt. Okay? Alright guys, love you. Bye. Why are you always in my junk, huh? Jeez, say hi to everybody. Say hi everybody. Oh. Say hi. Say hi. Hi everybody. Look at you. Is you. Look at you. Look at Nana. Oh.